Phase one of the Pollock Library's renovations is coming to an end. The renovations are part of CSUF's Library of the Future project, which aims to make advancements in technology and resource sharing centers for students and faculty. The plan includes moving majority computers from the first floor to the fourth floor, along with adding 160 seats, more collaborative spaces, more electrical outlets, and new whiteboards and furniture to the other floors. It's very beneficial because I personally get a lot of studying done in the library, and that's where I do a lot of my group projects. It's a quiet place to hang out, and I get all my work done. The first floor will be transformed into a student-centered area and will house many resource centers like Honors and Scholars Resource Center, African American Resource Center, Titan Dreamers Resource Center, and others. I didn't know they were there, so hopefully knowing that they're there, I can access them a lot easier. The renovation will be the end of preparations that began in March of 2014 in an effort to repair damages caused by a 5.1 earthquake that occurred. Well, I think as, as students were paying for this, that it makes more, it's better that they're using it now. And there's already so much overcrowding on campus. Like you see it with parking, you see it with, you're trying to find a spot to study in the library, you're trying to find a spot to study on campus. And so I think anything that opens up more space for us to be able to use is better so that we aren't basically stacked on top of each other when we're trying to get work done. The exact date of when phase two will begin is unknown. The plan is to start phase two at the start of 2018 if phase one finishes according to plan. Mariana Vera, CSUF News.